How to make videos using Doceri. First, click on your Doceri app icon and then select From My iPad Alone. To create a new project, click on the plus sign in the lower left hand corner. Here you have a choice of the resolution. I select the highest resolution. The whiteboard is Doceri's default. Click right here to see more patterns, colors, and custom backgrounds. Here's a list of the patterns. These are your color options. This is where you can store custom backgrounds. Here's an example of a white colored background, a blue colored background, a grid patterned background. Here's the grid background zoomed in and a yellow colored background with a black pen with adjustable thickness, adjustable spacing, and adjustable opacity. Click here to place an image in your project. Click select from iPhoto library. For this project, I selected a light bulb. I zoom the image as much as I can and trace the image. While I'm tracing, I'll zoom in and out to make sure that I get the image traced as carefully as I can. When I'm done tracing, it's time to make my video. Put your finger on this tag and swipe it down. That opens up this display. And what we need to do here is go back stroke by stroke all the way back to the very beginning of our tracing, even to the moment we inserted the picture. Drag this tiny square to the left. Slow down and stop the exact moment the image disappears. Press record. Press start recording. Once it's recording, you can also narrate, so you can record your voice while it's recording. Press play. Now it's going to play back through each stroke, every stroke without the background picture. And if it's going too slowly, you can actually grab it and slide it to the right at your own pace. Once it reaches the end and it stops moving, press stop recording. And then it gives you a chance to name your video. And it gives you a chance to save your video, share your video, upload to YouTube, set the video quality, or put your video in the trash. Let's save the video. You have to put your finger on the video thumbnail and drag it across the screen directly over the icon here. Next, you're given plenty of options to save the video. I'm just going to click Save Video. This is a recording of each stroke that was made as I traced the light bulb. As you can see here, it also gives it a unique effect when you play it backwards. I only use the color black in tracing the light bulb. Some images require a lot of detail and a lot of colors, and those are pretty cool to do. I made this Doceri video by tracing a picture with just one color and a contrasting background. And I made this video using Doceri freehand. And that's how you make a Doceri video.